layers of e-survey section. Hello everybody. Welcome to a video tutorial which explains the layer concept in e-survey CAD section module. In section module, when you import data, you have to specify the layer number. While creating assembly, you have to specify to which layer cross-section data has to be updated. When you derive a layer, you have to specify in which derived layer values to be posted. The layer table shown in the video explains about various layers that are used in e-survey section. Layer number 1 to 20. First 20 layers are for user input. For example, you may import ground data surveyed in various states as layer 1, layer 2, etc. 21 to 40. Cross-section template data which gets derived by applying cross-sectional template or assembly. 41 to 60. Layer data derived through various cross-sectional derived layers. 61 to 80. Cross-section template data which have to be computed considering the values in derived layer. 81 to 90. Unused. 81 to 86. Blank layers. Layer number 87 is cutting value, that is the difference between area calculation layer. Layer number 88 is the filling value, that is difference between area calculation layer. 89 is offset distance. 90 is cumulative offset distance and 91 to 103 is vertical alignment layer data in road design which is displayed in road design vertical alignment tab. Layer properties of each layer can be changed to suit the project requirement. Understanding this layer concept is very helpful in effectively utilizing the strength of the section module for complex requirements. Thank you for watching this video. In the next video, you will learn how to clear data of specific cross-section or specific layers from the current section project file.